Hi, it's Kristen Tollefson, the Education Director at the Bainbridge Island Museum of Art, here with another Art in Action BEMA from Home. Sometimes the best thing we can make is a connection with another person, and sometimes those relationships can be difficult. I've taken ideas from many different places and put them into a few short steps on how to have a difficult conversation. You can think of this as the beginning of a toolkit for learning how to jump into places with people that might be uncomfortable, that might be a little bit scary, and that might offer you some feeling of relief after you've gone through them. So let's walk through them together. How to have a difficult conversation. The first step is to show up as you are with all of your imperfections and your questions. When you're there, Embrace discomfort in all forms, including not knowing and the challenges inherent in grappling with difficult topics. Allow room for silence. Discomfort invites growth and learning. Listen with engagement and empathy. Focus on what is being said. Consider the meaning behind it. Refrain from internally crafting your response while the other person is talking. Stay open and curious. Curiosity can be the difference between conversation and argument. Ask for clarification. Words often mean different things to different people and misunderstanding is often a source of conflict. Restate or rephrase what was said. What I'm hearing is allows room for cl clarity through confirmation or correction. When you do speak, allow for shared perspectives. Find the similarities between your perspectives. You both may have different ways of reaching for a shared goal. Know when you need to take a break. It's okay to pause or table the discussion for another time. Finally, the hard conversation may need to start with yourself. How do biases inform your decision-making? Can you think of ways that you can identify and dismantle them? These ideas came from many resources, including the ones you see listed here. Do your own research and try out this process and make it your own. It will only make things better. I wanna encourage you to be brave, or bold, or both, and seize a moment to really care enough about someone to show up to have a hard talk with them. These steps might help you a little bit, and if they do, I hope you share them. As always, leave us a comment. We'd love to hear from you. And until next time, it's Art in Action.